This video helps you to understand your oxygen saturation readings. Your oxygen saturation describes how much oxygen is in your blood. This is a signal of how well your lungs are working. Oxygen saturation is measured non-invasively using a device called a pulse oximeter. You put this on your finger for about a minute to measure the oxygen in your blood. You need to record your oxygen saturation using the pulse oximeter four times daily. The app will prompt you when to do this. Make sure that you follow the instructions for using the pulse oximeter carefully. This means that you should remove all nail varnish and false nails, that your hands are clean and dry, and that you've sat at rest for at least five minutes. Ensure that the pulse oximeter is placed on the middle finger, palm facing upwards for the known in 3230 device, and on the middle finger, palm facing downwards for the contact CMS50M. Normal oxygen saturation are in the ranges of 95 to 100%. Lung conditions or infections, including coronavirus, can reduce your oxygen saturation. The lower the number is the less oxygen you have in your blood. If you get a borderline pulse oximeter reading of between 94 and 95 percent and you are breathless, you should telephone your healthcare provider now, GP or out of hours service or home monitoring service if instructed to do so. If you are not breathless, you will be prompted to repeat the test again in two hours so that you can be monitored more closely ensuring that you've been sitting at rest for at least five minutes before taking the second reading. If you repeat test results, stay around 94, 95%, this may be a sign your oxygen levels are getting worse. You'll be prompted to record your oxygen saturation more often. If your oxygen saturation falls to 93% or lower, or you experience an increased difficulty in breathing, it may be a sign that you need extra support such as oxygen therapy. Contact your healthcare provider, GP, out of hours service, or home monitoring service if instructed to do so. By telephone straight away and advise them of your oxygen saturation reading. This is the number that is displayed on your pulse oximeter. If you get a result of 93% or lower, you'll be asked to repeat the test again in five minutes. Ensure that you've been sitting at rest for at least five minutes before taking the second reading. If you repeat test results it is 93% or lower, this is a sign that you may need extra support, such as oxygen therapy. You should telephone your healthcare provider now, GP, out of hours service or home monitoring service if instructed to do so, and advise them of your oxygen saturation reading this is the number that's displayed on your pulse oximeter. If you develop breathlessness symptoms and you have not done so already, please take your oxygen saturation measurement using the pulse oximeter.